What is up YouTube, Lazy Llama here, and here we are with episode 80 of our Click Your Hero series. It is going great. Uh, we pushed really far this ascension. Uh, I'll show you real quick how we've been going. Um, you can see the first one that we did, uh, this is the one we went through yesterday, and then I did this and this, which we've just been pushing real far on that. But made quite a bit of zones, and we actually have a lot of hero souls to reset with now. So we are going to do that right off the bat. Uh, get our first click, which should give us plenty to buy Tree Beast, staying idle. Should get us through a while. Got to turn this on. Uh, but we did get into Atlas. I went to Atlas very briefly at the end. It wasn't most efficient. Uh, it was actually, I still technically should have just waited and stayed in Sam, but I did it anyways. Uh, but before we get to anything, let's actually not save yet. I lied, I lied, I lied. Let's buy the rest of our ancients that we want. Obviously, you. Um, Afgar. Actually, I don't know if I want to buy all of them yet. Kind of want to optimize what we got. But I do kind of want all of them as well. They don't really cost much at this point to just get. Don't really need these guys yet. Uh, we'll take him. Is that everything? Afgar, Atman, Kronos, Dogcog, Dora, Ortuna, Kuma, Libertas, Ammon. We're missing. Oh, no, those are three golds. Yep. No, that's everything. I believe that's all of them. I don't want to pick up any more. Really? Right now? I don't think it's necessary. Now, I'm pretty sure that's all of them. Either way, we're going to just optimize what we got here. Let me just save this so we can import it into the calculator because it helps out so much. Uh, and then just grab 100 levels of everything back here. Available upgrades. That should hold for a bit. Pop this in here. Uh, it's not going to leave us with much left to re-guild, which isn't really going to work for me. Uh, I definitely need some left over to re-guild with, so... We're going to have to find out what we do. So what I don't like about the uh, the early stages of this, the calculator doesn't really set up for that. That was such a big jump. Uh, but let's get Solomon up. Could have just probably skipped out on... I could probably skip out on some of them. We're just two lower levels of them. See a lot of us. We gotta level up the other guy manually because uh, they're not identical yet. So it's a whole nother number to add. So now they're even. Uh, -ba -ba -ba. This dude up here. And then the three gold guys are even, so we can just go through and throw those in. We got those last episode, I believe. Maybe I did it in between, actually, in between episodes. I did pick up a couple other guys, I remember. I just don't know who. Door is going to get expensive, but it wants four into there. I want to keep some again. One, two, three, four. All right, that's where a lot of it was. Atman wants four as well. One, two, three. Four. All right. Um, and then it just kind of split, like Daka, Fortuna are both four. I'm not going to do those. I do want to get Kuma up some levels. Okay, I'm just going to kind of free ball the rest of these. I want to leave myself with some, like I said, left. But the first couple levels of this are cheap enough. I did get it up to a full 1%. Oh, screw it. We'll leave it at 18,000. 18,000 should be enough. It's actually higher than the one it is to get Kuma to. No, that's exactly the exact level I wanted to get them to. Cool. That's where we're leaving it, so. That'd be nice. Some of them I know that need to go above 100. I just kind of throw to 200 if I can afford it. I think that's everyone up there so far. Nice. Awesome. Things are going well. I'm not going to worry about reloading this. We're just going to do that. Just gonna do that for now. We're not gonna do the reload. Uh, but yeah, that's where the engine's going. We're doing really well now. Again, I'm pretty sure that's all of the ones we need. We'll end up getting all the other ones soon enough anyways. I'm not gonna wait too long before I get my uh, hybrid build going. So, And I'll probably turn it over to more of an active build on the sooner side. Although, you sometimes run the gold issues. And then again, insta-killing is slightly slower. But uh, yeah, you can see kind of how that went. I'll go through this again. You can see we went from the 320. Uh, again, a very far pushed. Uh, we couldn't actually push that f as far within the short time we did. Again, we did two like one hour ascensions, which are awesome. Helped out a ton, and then we went flying 
through this one for a while and I pushed this up a little bit I'm um, hoping now we can easily go and break like 1500 um, I'm sure we'll like way overshoot that so now that we got uh, Avgar it's gonna help out a ton too But uh, yeah, now it's just a matter of kind of leveling up. I'm pretty excited to see how much we get off the first kill. Okay, we got just over the mill, which is nice. I did, uh, we did do the raid as well, which I got. That's not how much I got. I got like 7,000. I should have ascended first and then collected because it would have been more helpful. I used actually the 7,000 to regild into Atlas though. I'm hoping I can skip right over Sam to Atlas with the current build so I don't have to regild into Sam and then to Atlas. Obviously, I'll level Sam to get to Atlas, but I'm hoping we can just straight skip it, which I'm like 95% sure we can do. I'm pretty sure we can pull that off. Well, we're coming up on 100. Uh, the insta kill through all these is just awesome. You do about 100 levels. It seems like about 5 minutes. 5 minutes or so, maybe a little more. What do you guys generally go to your active build? Like, at what point in the ascension do you guys pick up your ancients to go active? Like, again, I could have technically afforded them all now. Uh, I just like to, I like to optimize first. Generally, I don't even like grabbing as many as I am now, but we just got a million years, so it's kind of hard not to grab a bunch. But, uh, yeah, when do you guys like to go hybrid? I'm curious, because I know a bunch of people are very different times on that. Some people like to wait a while, and some people kind of get into it really fast. But next next go around, maybe not next one, actually. It might be the one after. It should be having us keep enough to where I don't really have to pay too much attention. But it was going to leave me with like, uh, like 4,000, or sorry, like 2,000 or something. And that's definitely not enough to, uh, to do anything with. We'll come down here, start leveling up some Sam. Why not? We can actually get the cat or the um, the clicker on it. And yeah, hopefully that just carries till we can afford Atlas. I I'm like like I said, I'm pretty positive it will. Uh, as far as guilds go, I think we're at like 92. Oh, we can put that one in there. 93. Uh, again, that's with our six. We got all of them, which is awesome. I'd like to get more of those. We actually do have a quite a bit of gems, and I kind of want to do it. I'll probably wait till next uh, next time we transcend though before I buy more. So I kind of want to try that thing where I do it at the beginning and I just buy as many as I can, so it goes right in tree beast like right at the beginning. Which I mean really won't matter, but it'll be kind of cool. Like at the first go, like first ascension, then you can just max tree beast instead of worrying about all of them with like you know six to nine <laughs> guilds in it. And I do want to buy more of those. I think that's better than the auto clickers for us at this stage. I don't really think we need any more. Yeah, we can do more boss damage and stuff, but I'm not really concerned about that. Already up over a thousand, which is awesome. Man, I'm so excited to be back in the in the transcendence and moving nicely, but I feel like it just takes so long to get back to where we were. Get back into Wep and then Midas. And again, hopefully back into Wep and maybe even to him this Transcendence. I don't think so. We probably don't actually get to him for like two more Transcendence. But I really don't know. I know that jump between him to him and like so on is really long. This dude looks cool though. He looks like, um, it's hard to see without a little picture. But kind of like, it's just a dude wearing like some kind of like, like foresty like hat or whatever. I was looking at like sticks coming out of like ears or something. And then his hammer. I had to look at a bigger picture of him. Or zoom in on him. That's what it kind of looks like. I don't really know what it is. So. Is it time Oh yeah, I guess. Wow. I didn't realize how far in we are. I'm like looking at that. Wait, we don't have any cooldown stuff yet. Why is that so short? Uh, as for... Um, where am I going? Relics go. I don't think I replaced anything but... Uh, this one. I put this one in instead of another plus two door, I believe. Because uh, I wanted the Solomon at this at the point of the game. I feel like the Solomon would have been more help than uh, 
then another Dora, which I mean we lost 40%, but we gained uh, 82, as you can see. Sorry, I'm kind of yawning. Very tired right now, actually. I stayed up late. I've been on the weekends. I'm always up late, so. But I've uh, <laughs> been up late and haven't got much sleep. Pretty exhausted. I've been out all day doing some cool stuff. Um, yeah. Yeah, it's 36 billion is our max. I'd love to be breaking that. I mean, we're already gaining so many. I mean, not even at 200 yet. We've already got 20,000. That's amazing. And then, um, mercenaries are going well. So far, Pasha seems to be doing good, which is scary. Uh, Tyler hasn't died yet. And he's about halfway through-ish. Four hours, I'll be halfway through. Um, I don't even know really why I'm doing this, but... We did lose someone. I forget the name, and I can't remember if it was in the video. I don't think it was. But we did lose someone. It was like a level one. I didn't want to spend like 12 gems to revive him. So I said, screw it, let him die. And just recently, I was able to get them back on the case here. <laughs> but uh, we got pretty, I mean, two, like, I guess five is average. Like, five's not bad. Like, five to eight, I'd consider, like, kind of like average. Eight's getting pretty good. Like, would you get the demigod status? Like, that's when they become like fairly valuable. I mean, it's not too bad. But dude, Pasha, I'm so hoping. Oh, let's see what our relic is. Crap. Complete crap. Goes up by ten. All right. That's our last one. Yep. Awesome. Boom. Making some forge cores. So we got some decent forge cores, which is nice. Uh, been doing that just to obviously. We're going to need four chores to level them up later on when we actually get some decent ones. No admin ones yet. I'm not really too concerned about them yet. I'm hoping, honestly, by the time this one's done, we'll have reset a couple times. I mean, I don't really know how many times I'm going to reset tonight. But I'm hoping, you know, by that time, we'll be at a higher level to where relics we get from this will be useful. Which, honestly, 28 hours, that's quite a bit of time. Uh, I should have time to get up in zones. Like I said, it's been going good. You can see we're already two days into this transcendence uh, time-wise, which is not too bad progress. Five ascensions, two days. I mean, I could have done way more because you can do so many resets. I just, I don't really sit on the game much. Most of it's when I play the videos or sometimes I'm play, playing like Smite or another game I play or other recordings and I bounce in and out and I'll be like, oh, we could use a ascension and I'll spend the five minutes setting it up, getting, you know, all this going and boom. Um, but anyways, I'm gonna hop over and start going over the clan data. And we'll see what's going on. Alrighty, so real quick to go over stuff. I can state right off the bat that Lamination and Lamination 3, no one has gone up any zones. Um, which is kind of funny. I know a lot of us are in the middle of Transcendence. Um, everyone seems to be active within those two, except for Goldie. Which, I'm going to give a bit of time still. But Goldie, if you're inactive, man, just... You know, let us know so we can, you know, have you move out so someone else can come in. I know there's a bunch of people that want to play, and honestly, I could fill up probably two more clans worth with the way things are going pretty quickly, um, which I just don't have the time to manage two other clans yet. Uh, I'm still working on some things with that. Um, I've almost got enough. Uh, there's really only one more clan we need an officer for, um, which, you know, congrats to Eric. He is now the officer of Lam Empire, um, which is amazing. Uh, he's been around for quite some time. I mean, he was... I don't know when did Eric came in. He's been around for a while, like, and uh, I've talked to him quite a bit, and he's he has been around for a good while. But um, anyways, welcome him to the uh, the officer ranks. Uh, honestly, on for this first page, the only ones to go up was Sam in Lamination Two, which congrats to you went up like 200 zones, uh, and one, two, three, four, five, who I believe went up about 200, 100 to 200 zones as well. So congrats to you, fellas, um, for being the only ones on the top. Funny to actually move zones and actually uh, I, I didn't actually organize ranks so some people might be off on this like page actually I think I see one now and I'm probably gonna forget to edit it before the end of this um, I haven't really had time actually not I'll edit it as we go but sorry uh, sway star is actually popped in front of uh, shadow master so and I gotta just switch them out real quick but uh, anyways congrats to starry sorry sway star for uh, moving up um, some zones. I don't know exactly what it was that last episode. Again, I don't think he moved up tons, but he made some progress, so that's always a plus. 
Uh, OMG has not done anything, and actually uh, Eric pointed it out that he hasn't seen him do any activity since Eric's been around, and he hasn't before, and OMG actually got kicked, I think, a while back from Lama Nation uh, alone uh, for being inactive. Uh, dude, if you can't play, man, I gotta open the spot for someone else, man. I don't know what's going on. You haven't attacked in a couple days. You haven't seemed to chat. I don't think you're over in the Discord. Uh, so hop in the Discord. Let us know you're active, and if you're you know in the middle of a transcendence, you can't at least get your attacks in at the bare minimal. But again, try to get in the community. Like that's the whole point. We're trying to grow this. You know, become friends, chat. You know, all this stuff. Big family. But uh, anyways, uh, I'm not putting you in the chopping block quite yet. I talked to Eric. Um, we're gonna give you another day before we. You know, do something like that, but uh, it's in the works. Uh, Plurred. I love Plurred. I love just saying Plurred, even though it's still probably completely wrong and it's probably like PLRD or something. Uh, but we're going to stick with uh, Plurred. But he's went up exactly 200 zones, went from 1400 to 1600. Congrats, man. Uh, Eric has gone up a bit. Maybe not, actually. Did I not update Eric? I feel like I didn't update Eric. Uh, let me just check. <laughs> I feel like I didn't. Uh, while we're waiting, just I want to check out this too. Yeah, so 13. That's not bad. Got that fish while we're at it. But, uh, yeah, let me see real quick. Eric did. Yeah, he did. I didn't update him. Uh, I'll update him in the video so you'll, you guys will see it. But 11.39. That's pretty nice, man. Congrats. Uh, things are still kind of weird with the way I was, like, updating him. So he was an, he was still, like, on the green. <laughs> so, but 11.39. That's, that's awesome, man. You're moving along nicely. Uh, we got only one, uh, two more, two more people. Do you guys like the pluses that I'm doing just so you can see who's actually went up? I think it's kind of nice. It helps me like in general, just so I can see, you know, who I got to mention, but, uh, boss Ohm has moved up a bit, just a couple zones, nothing crazy. Then real King, like I said, is moving along swiftly, uh, actually really nicely in general. That's, yeah, that's amazing actually. He's, uh, he's moved up a couple, too, which I've got to move him around. But he's moving closer to transcending, which, I mean, it'll still probably be maybe a... I mean, honestly, tomorrow he could hit it, to be completely honest. It is possible to hit from where he's at. So, who knows? That'd be amazing. Uh, and also, we did get Bubble in here. Because, like, one of the placeholders is now out. Because Eric moved from Lamination 2 to uh, Lam Empire. So, I had someone leave for a minute. Uh, actually... Oop, I moved some things up, but, uh, yeah, someone popped out for me for a minute so I could, you know, change it. End hog actually did. I'll throw, throw his name in there. Thank you for that, man. Uh, he popped out just so we could have Eric come in. I could promote him and then leave with the, the placeholder. That's kind of what went down with that, but things are going well. Uh, things are, again, we have one more placeholder, which will be getting no open slot still. Uh, once I fill out this other placeholder, we're going to go for a couple days, see how things go with all the officers and stuff, and then we'll talk about another clan, because we might need it, to be honest. Like I said, we could probably fill out like two others pretty quick, but uh, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how things go. But nonetheless, uh, we could do an attack on the boss real quick while we wait. Let's pull that off. Anyone attack yet? Yeah, Noodle's in there. Noodle's doing some decent damage. Uh, he's on a transcendence as well. I do know that. Working his way up. He attacks every single day. He's like one of those that like I know. It's always like me or him attacking first, generally. Um, yesterday, or you know, sorry, the day before, I was really slacking on it. <laughs> I, actually, I waited till like the last hour. I well, honestly 100% forgot about it. It just it slipped by my mind. And <laughs> Real actually mentioned it. He's like, not too many people attack today. And it's like, I'm just messing with him, tell him that. Uh, I was just trying to give him a chance, Oop, chance to attack before, you know, I killed it, and obviously I do zero damage to it, as you can see. But I don't think Clan Two, or I'm gonna say Lamination Two, it's not really Clan Two anymore because it's not like it goes in number orders like it used to. Because now we have Lama Empire, and I will need names for another clan. So if you want, throw some names in the comment section. I will possibly even just pull things from it. It'll probably have Lama in the name, obviously. Um, but there's obviously the debate of doing uh, Llama Empire 2 and 3, but I don't think I want to do that. I think I want to do like different names for everything now. Um, but we'll see. I've got I've got some personal ideas. I don't want to mention them, 
But uh, I do have some ideas in my head, so it's not like I'm waiting on a name or something. Again, I want to see how things go. I still got to get another officer, and I want to give it time to where I trust some of these other people to where they can possibly be officers of new clans when I first start them. So I don't even have to have a placeholder in there from the get-go. But, uh, you know, we'll see how things go with that. But we're flying through these zones. This is awesome. We have so many hero souls already. By the time we're, you know, pushing wherever we get to, honestly, we could get to towards 2K, which would be phenomenal. Um, we're we're going to be making some good progress. But uh, anyways, that's going to be it for this video, guys. Hope you guys did enjoy. Um, this series is going awesome. I can't believe we're 80 episodes in. I don't know what to say. I mean, 100 is just around the corner. It really is. But uh, yeah, anyways, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.